all the prophets in the book look like me and you. All of them. Read. Job chapter 30, verse 30. This is the prophet Job. Chapter 30, verse 30. Read. My skin, My skin, skin is black. You see that? His skin is black. Different variations of brown. He a dark skinned man. Read that again. My skin is black. So who is that white image they put all throughout the churches? Of the Son of God. And his people. Job said his skin is black. Drop that. Give me uh, Song of Solomon 1 and 5. Start at Sol Song of Solomon 1 and 1. Come on. Yep. Song of Solomon. Read chapter 1. Chapter 1, verse 1. Come on. The Song of Songs, which is Solomon's. You know why I read that? Because I want you to know that King Solomon wrote it. Because in the Christian church, they'll say, ha, ha. One of Solomon's women wrote that. Ha, ha. Solomon had a black lover. Ha, ha, ha. That's what they say in the church. No. Read that again. The Song of Songs, which is Solomon's. It's the Song of Songs, which is Solomon's. Just like Tupac Shakur wrote songs. William Shakespeare wrote songs and poems. King Solomon wrote songs and poems. And this is one of his songs. Read on. Verse 5. I am black. King Solomon said, I am black. He's writing a poem for the nation of Israel and, and God. The relationship between God and Israel. It ain't no homosexual stuff going on. It's a, it's a parable. Because God compares... The nation of Israel, almost like his wife. We marry. You understand that we are in a relationship. He would be the position of the husband. The nation of Israel, we like his lovely wife. So it's, it's like poetic. You understand that? So the point is, this ain't poetic. This is literal right here, verse 5. He goes back and forth from being poetic to being literal. Verse 5 is literal. Read that. I am black. He's what? I am black. What color is King Solomon? Black. That's the son of David. That's the same lineage that Christ came from. Christ came from David. He came from King Solomon. All the way down. Christ is the son of David. Solomon is the son of David. He said, I'm what? I am black. King Solomon said, I am black. What color was Job? My skin is black upon me. That's what he said. Read. But comely. But I'm comely. Remember in the 70s we said we black and beautiful? That's what King Solomon just, just said. He said, I'm black, but I'm beautiful though. I'm comely. Comely is another word for beautiful. I'm not black and dusty. Read. Oh, ye daughters of Jerusalem, uh -huh. as the tents of Kedar. Kedar are the Arabians. He said, I'm black like the Kedar, like the Kardarians. I'm, I'm black like them. Read. As the curtains of Solomon. But I'm beautiful like the curtains of Solomon. I'm black like them, but I ain't dusty like them. That's what he's, he's throwing shots at them. That's you right. understand me? He said, yeah, I'm black like the Arabians, but I'm beautiful like an Israelite. Just like us, we black, but we the most beautiful race on the face of the earth. It just is what it is. And that's right. not an opinion. The most beautiful models come from us. We the most handsome. We the most beautiful looking people. But we destroy ourselves with drugs. We destroy ourselves with gluttony. You know what gluttony is? Overeating. We destroy ourselves with, give me some more uh, yoga now. We destroy ourselves with crack cocaine and, 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 and just sin, period. Read. I am black, uh -huh. but comely. Verse 6. Verse 6. Look not upon me, because I am black. You know what it means, look not upon me because I'm black? You know how a lot of times when you was younger, the dark-skinned kid got made fun of? Oh, you black. You black. He said, don't look upon me because I'm black. Read. Revelation chapter 1, verse 14. Uh -huh. His head and his hairs were white like wool. See that? This is the Son of God. Read verse 1 to prove it. Verse 1. The revelation of Jesus Christ. This is the revealing, the revelation of Jesus Christ. Y'all know what Jesus Christ is? Jesus Christ is the Son of God. You understand that? Out of all the, the, the men, the male Israelites, he's our older brother. He's the firstborn. And we was born after him. We are the sons of God. But he is the Son of God. He was the first Son of God. You understand that? And he comes from the tribe of Judah. That's the black American race today. You understand that? Read. Which God gave unto him uh -huh. to show unto his servants. We are the servants of God. Read. Things which must shortly come to pass. Verse 14. Verse 14. His head. The head on his hands. And his hairs. And the hairs on his face. Were white. Were white. white. Were white. The closest we can get today is fully gray. No. White. His is pure white. Read. Were white like wool. And not only was it pure white, but it was woolly. Who got the fully hair today? We do. That's how we have braids. That's how we have afros. That we, that's how we have twists. 
That's how we have our, our fades. We can do all type of things with our wall because we have the bully head. We can style it any type of way we want to. Now you know that Christ was what? He was a black man. That's right. You understand that? Read that again. Read on. His head and his hairs were white like wool. Uh -huh. It's white as snow. Read. And his eyes were as flame of fire. The whites of his eyes was red. Because when you read Matthew 11, Matthew 10, he drank wine. His first miracle was what? Who's going to drink? Who's going to turn water to wine if they don't drink wine? He drank wine, Dad. Did he get drunk? No. Burrito. And his feet. And his feet. If I kick my shoes off, my feet the same color as my arms, my neck, my face. So Christ's feet was the same, same color as all the rest of his body. It was what? Like a fine brass. Brass is a what color? It's brown. His feet was as fine brass. Read. As if. Now take that fine brass. As if they burned in a furnace. Christ is burnt. He was a very dark skinned man. You understand? Would y'all believe that? Not only was Christ black, but he was the blackest of us. That's right. You understand that? And his voice as the sounds of many waters. And he spoke very loudly. Y'all ever been in Niagara Falls or any type of loud waterfall? You ever heard of the ocean? The ocean is very loud. You're like, damn. That's when Christ spoke. He was able to preach multitudes of people. We got to use a speaker. <laughs> you understand that? So Christ was a black man, very dark skin, and he had a loud voice. That sounds like a black man. What will he have? That is a black man. Yeah, it is a thank you, sister. I like that. I like that faith. She said, that is a black man. That's right. That, that takes faith to make that statement. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, Nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road. Purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana. Sierra Leone, 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.